How's it going, folks? How's it going? You already know the waves, and for sure, you already know the vibes. It is Zachariah White, aka King Big Daddy Drip. Back at it like it's nothing with this drip and the sauce, because I am the boss. I am back. We are here. Happy good day to every single one of you ladies and gentlemen out there in the world. All right. Now, at the time that I'm recording this video, it is 1235 in the morning. All right. So happy, terrific, and thankful Tuesday. And I'm going to do my best to get this out to you guys as soon as possible because I know that for a couple of things that I have in mind to talk about, uh, it's definitely going to be going down very, very soon. But nonetheless, though, wait, listen, I'm, I'm jumping a gun. I'm all over the place, man. Y'all already know. The king has nothing but good luck, good fortune, good blessings, just positivity, good vibes, just any peace, love, all of that, man. That is what I'm praying, you know, not only just for myself, not only just for my, my family and my friends, but for all of my brothers and sisters out there, man. All right, because we all truly deserve that. But nonetheless, though, let's go ahead and put that off to the side because you already know why the king is up on the mic and you already know why the king is up on the screen. It is another episode of the News of the people brought to you by the internal sphere and the news of the world brought to you by the external sphere and a co of course the internal sphere and the external sphere are both coming together to bring to you the word on what's going on in today's society and for this particular go around i'm actually going to be showing some love to tallahassee i'm going to be showing some love of course to the dominican student association up at florida state university now i ended up making a video not too long ago uh you know speaking about dsa of course because you know they are they always doing something they're always doing something but nonetheless that's exactly how you got to be especially in today's time man always going you know always you know keeping it going and keeping it flowing when it comes to the growth and development all right and i say this dsa has there it looks like they're going to be involved in at least three different events all right by the way guys if the last time that i made a video i told y'all about how they had open positions so again for my folks up there, you know, at, in, in, in the 850, especially if you happen to be Dominican, y'all definitely make sure that y'all hit up DSA, man, if y'all are interested in being an outreach coordinator or a public relations chair or an event coordinator, all right? Just to let y'all know. And also, applications will be due May the 1st. But really, I'm going to go ahead and get to all the other stuff that I wanted to tell y'all about because um, from what it is that I happen to see, it looks like... <laughs> And as I'm looking at this particular event, I can tell y'all this is this is one of the staples when it comes to DSA and also when it comes to this other organization that I'm about to mention. <laughs> let me just let me just go ahead and give a huge shout out to the to the Casa family. Pardon me. All right, because I almost I, I almost called them um, Cubanos, and which by the way they are Cuban Cubanos, uh, but. Essentially, this particular event that, that you know, I, I guess that has popped up on my screen is the Hispanic Spelling Bee, all right? Now, I know they, they have this event every single spring. Every single spring, man. It's been a staple for at least a couple of years, all right? But nonetheless, DSA and CASA are coming together, of course, to, to put on this particular event. Uh, and from what it is that I can see, of course, there's a couple of prizes, all right? So for it, for, for my folks up there in Tallahassee, all right, uh, especially, hey, listen, <laughs> if, if y'all have nothing going down, well, y'all, I, I, it wouldn't matter if y'all had something going down or not. Y'all still should be pulling up to this event. <laughs> but especially if you don't have anything going down, April 18th at 6 p.m. in Bellamy, room number 003. Of course, this is where the Hispanic Spelling Bee is going to be going down. By the way, if you guys need any local landmarks as far as where the Bellamy building is, I can tell y'all just off the top of my head, the Bellamy building ha happens to be right by the HCB building, which also happens to be right, um, right in the same vicinity as the new student union which also happens to be right by um ooh, what auditorium is that right by more auditorium right by the robetta student um the robetta business um business you know building or whatever business class that 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 robetta robetta <laughs> pardon me I'm, I'm stuttering a little bit but uh, I, i'll say a, a better landmark um, especially better description than what I just provided. Uh, I know Bellamy also happens to be right by the, um, 
right by Strozier Libra Library. So all of those are landmarks that you that you can utilize to make sure that you're within the right area. Uh, but again, April 18, 6 p.m., Bellamy room number 003. Um, and I'm gonna just go ahead and read the caption because I know that the caption's got more information than what the heck it is that I'm spewing off at the mouth about, all right? But the caption reads, Hola, mi gente. Join us on Thursday to test your spelling skills at the fourth annual Hispanic Spelling Bee. See, I told y'all. I freaking told y'all. And then it says, No se lo pi, uh, lo, wow. No se lo, uh, pierdan. My apologies if I, ha if I happen to butcher that last word. But all in all, though, listen. Again, huge shout outs to DSA and huge shout outs to Casa for putting this on. But this will be going down a couple days from now. So y'all make sure that y'all mark this on your calendars. Another date that y'all are going to want to mark down on your calendars is April the 21st. Reason being is because it looks like DSA is going to be, I believe, are they partnering up? Of course they're partnering up with another organization. And guess who they're partnering up with, right? They're partnering up with the Puerto Rican Student Association. By the way, PRSA, big shout out to y'all. And they're partnering up with the Afro-Latinx Student Association, Afro-Latinx. Big shout out to y'all as well because, I, I, dang, I think they, um, speaking of also they ended up doing i want to say a field day event with csa or they're about to I, I i know i remember the event but as far as when that's going down that happens to to be slipping my mind but nonetheless though dsa times prsa times also all three organizations got that pool party going down and it looks like this will be going down um at 2 p.m april the 21st location u club phase two and y'all already know food and drinks are going to be provided only thing y'all got to make sure that y'all pull up with is yourselves and of course y'all make sure that y'all bring good vibe the good vibes pardon me all right because uh there's already going to be a whole lot of good energy up in the mix all right but we got that particular event so of course the hispanic spelling bee as well as the pool party but the third thing the last this is this is certainly not least all right all my folks up in tallahassee y'all are definitely going to want to pop out to this all right because there's latin night on friday april the 26th all right now the 26th like i guess more specifically um the, it looks like the theme is la despedida wow la despedida all right i gotta slow down um let me just go ahead and read the caption though. Of course, it's Tallahassee's biggest Latin night returns for one last time this semester on Friday, April the 26th. Damn, man, one last, one last Latin night. Now that I just read that first sentence, y'all, make sure that y'all pull up, man, because I'm gonna get to who the DJs are, but y'all, listen, if y'all don't pull up for this last Latin night, I don't know what the hell y'all got going on, man. I don't know what, man. Listen, Latin Nights is, in my in my opinion, Latin Nights have been the most fun, like the the most, the, like the best parties to pull up to. All right, Latin Nights is always a, a, a vibe, head and shoulders above everything else, in my opinion. My apologies to, to any and everybody else, but uh, but all in all, though, again, Tallahassee's biggest Latin night returns for one last time this semester, Friday, April the 26th. Tickets on sale now, uh, and then of course, you know, you guys can feel free to DM DSA for physical slash digital copy, or you could also utilize the DSA code online for. They don't mention how many how how much money you get off, but I know that you for sure happen to to um, get a couple dollars off. And as far as who the DJs are, man, listen, you got you got some of my favorite DJs up in the mix, man. You got none other than DJ Chalo, you got DJ uh, Tally Cartel, you got DJ Izzy B, and you got DJ Bass Pay as well. So big shout outs to all four of those, man, all four of those DJs. Uh, but uh, outside of that, though, that's all that I have. I know I, I, I went on for a good bit, so I'm not even going to hold up i'm not even going you know take up much more of your time but i do thank y'all for spending some valuable time with the king y'all definitely make sure that y'all like this video up share this with any and everybody subscribe to the youtube channel it's just my name zachariah white make sure that not only make sure that y'all like make sure of course that y'all follow my social media pages but also make sure that y'all follow you know the social media pages of dsa prsa also and and uh, casa as well and also make sure that y'all follow the social media 
media pages of my partners in crime, you know, Samaya, Logan, and Mason. But the most important thing, make sure that you stay tuned, stay tapped in, and stay locked in because the juice over here never stops dripping. All right? All right. Now, I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace, be easy, and as always, y'all stay blessed up. Yeah, yeah, yeah.